What's going on, guys? Welcome to the second fan mail in Georgia. So guys, uh, a lot of this stuff has been pulled. Uh, I mean, there was a couple of things that I found from Virginia Beach, like this one. I know, Virginia Beach, fucking, you know, a couple years back. Uh, and then we have a couple other things in here from uh, the P.O. Box and Hurricane that I ended up finding. Uh, this one I think is pretty new. I think there's another one that's pretty new in here as well. So we still have some surviving. I am requesting the thing to uh, go get my P.O. Box, guys. Like I said, I appreciate all the support on my last vlog. People telling me what I should do uh, to be able to get the proof of address. Uh, that's going to be no issue. I should be able to go to uh, the DMV either Tuesday or Wednesday next week uh, and should be able to get a P.O. Box set up um, next week. I, I think I may have an enough fan mail for one more fan mail i think that's literally it um i will let you guys know for sure if not i'll put the other hockey video or some type of video of me going to get the p.o box basically if we don't have a fan mail next week what we will have for sure is a p.o box announcing video um so next week i may i will have a p.o box so i should be able to if we can't if we can't have one friday maybe like a mini one i'll basically announce on friday the p.o box and everything so you guys can start sending stuff in so we can get this uh you know this Ow, fucking green screen. I can get this off the ground and whatnot. So, guys, without further ado, let's do this. So, guys, I've been playing uh, the new Division game. Uh, I was really into Division 1. Uh, we're playing the Division 2 beta. I'm already pretty far along in it. Uh, we'll be playing it tonight on stream, twitch.tv slash yummygaming. I'll see you guys there at about 6 o'clock. If you don't want to be there, then honestly, just go away. Uh, but we'll be playing it tonight. Don't be a 5-year-old and you won't get banned. All right, this one is uh, for Yummy Loves Drew. Um, it's from Singapore. So, this is from China. Oh. All right, so I'm pretty confident this is a giant fucking box of Tim Tams. All right, we do have a, that's a letter, not a thingy, a giant box of single serve Tim Tams. I say, out of all the Tim Tams I've ever gotten, I've never gotten a single serve Tim Tam. So, this is actually pretty uh, interesting. It's literally a single cookie. That's That seems like a whole waste of space. Thank you so much for the Tim Tams. If you guys remember back in the day, you used to be obsessed with these things when you couldn't get them in America, and now they're in every fucking chain store on the planet. So, uh, you can get them here now. Thank you for the Tim Tams. I hate you. Can't wait to give you guys my bill one day for when I have osteoporosis. I mean diabetes! Here we go. Here's a package that's been marinating for the past two and a half years. This is for, for Yummy R6 in Virginia Beach. I know. You guys are gonna like be like, Dick, why didn't you ever open these? Well, they were lost, asshole. We got in here. Oh, we got a pop. We got we got two pops. Well, pippity poppity. Check it out. We got a Bobo Fett prototype pop. Definitely have a bunch of these. And then we have another one of these damn glow-in-the-dark Yodas. I only have 17,000 of those. And pops are always loved. I'm going to put them over here. The letter, though. Let's, let's read this. Let me see if there's a date. November 18, 2016. This is like three years ago, bro. But I looked in the list and really hope uh, I'm the first to send these. This is my first fan mail ever for the channel. The Yoda glows in the dark and the Boba Fett is a prototype uh, from uh, um, something. And then he sent a personal message that I guess I'm not allowed to read. Well, uh, my guy, I'm sorry it took this long to open your package. Uh, there was a lot of lost fan mail here and there. Uh, when you have a thousand items plus, uh, it is very hard to keep stuff organized. So for you guys that I am opening up fan mail from Virginia Beach, I do apologize. Uh, it shit happens, guys. I'm not perfect. I am human. Get lost. Things get stacked up. Things get placed in places that... I don't expect them to be, and then I find them when I'm moving, taking everything out. So, uh, you know, excuse me, okay? Don't be a dick. Another one for Yummy R6. This is from Stroop. Uh, I think that's what that says. Stroop, I believe, is who this person is. I, I don't know what their name is. Here we go. Let's get this bad boy open. Let's see what we got here. Um, what the fuck is that? Sorry. Hey, my name is Joey. I think I'm supposed to say I live in Texas or Colorado. What? Whenever you open this package. I hope to get a Harley and a sports bike when I move. Love the vids. Keep it up. Keep riding. P.S. Ponies for you. Put it with your pops. Well, you know what? Thank you so much. My little pony. My little pony. This thing is kind of fucking weird. So to the My Little Pony. Uh... I don't know what I'm supposed to do with it, but you know what? I wish I still lived in West Virginia because then I could give this to um, uh, DRZ's uh, uh, daughter. She'd probably love it. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. It'll look very pretty sitting. Is that balloons on its ass? Oh, this pony has got some hoe tattoos. It got balloons on her ass. Guess that you know what must be popping. Ha! <laughs> okay, that was a joke. Not for the age of my people watching the channel. I'm going to hell. What do we got in here? Uh, this is something from China. Uh, it's just for Yummy R6. Uh, this is a P.O. Box 215, so West Virginia. Feels like a shirt. A shirt from China. And here, looks kind of like Darth Vader, maybe. No, this is The Walking Dead. 
How dare I get the two confused? All right, let's see what we got in here. All right, whoa, this shirt feels weird. What the hell? It is, here we go. Oh, it's like a silky shirt. It's like silky and shit. But it's like, it's like, whoa, what's on the back? Check it out. We got like little, I'm like an angel or something. This is like, this is like uh, silky. It's like stretchable. But then like this isn't stretchable. It's like, this is pretty cool. I don't know why there's angels on this. Uh, I don't know if he's like dead or something now. I'm not sure. But zero tolerance for walkers. Yes, I agree, Daryl Dixon. This is actually a really nice shirt. So the fact that this was made in like China is actually pretty pretty awesome thank you so much man i appreciate this shirt whoever sent it uh 17 years ago uh you're muchly greatly appreciated oh by the way no shooting airsoft guns into these walls it's really expensive to fix here uh yummy r6 po box 55187 in virginia beach god i don't even remember that address i hated, I hated how virginia beach's po boxes were so ridiculously long like i had to have like 10 letters and characters and everything and it. it was so dumb a pop he got an imperial guard check it out oh it felt it's like I'm a banana, I'm a banana, real quick, beat, boo! Got some, like, body issues, poor guy. All right, what do we got? We got some letters in here. Let's see how old this thing is. Ordered on uh, December 17th of 2016. God damn, this shit's old. What happened in November and December of 2016 that we lost everything? We saw, enjoy watching Family Friday vid in videos. Uh, lots of luck with your pop collection. Ride safe and keep it well from Ram. Oh, Ram, thank you so much. Again, I do apologize to you that it took so long to get your package in the, you know, fan mail thing. Oh, I didn't realize that was on that. I need to take that off. How dare I? Looking at these stickers, man, it's so cool sitting all the, uh, all the, all the, just like the the times remember when we did that i do remember when we pooped today i do this is this is these are like it's just so crazy such old stickers such amazing memories on this table isn't it here we go this one's from rhino jixer oh my god this one's uh this was p.o box 215 uh yo rhino jixer has been following guys look, listen here this guy sent fan mail to one of my first ever fan mails and has sent fan mail ever since like he's always sends fan mail like he he like Okay, he hasn't in a while, but like this guy, he's been around my channel forever, dude. It's crazy. What's going on, Rhino Jigsaw? How are you, buddy? All right, what have we got in here? Tampons? Yes, finally. What is this? I got a litter in here? Maybe not. Um, we got some Kleenex. That's pretty cool. We got a football sh Oh, that is badass! Check it out! It's a football shot glass. So it's a, it's a shot glass, but with a football shape in the inside? Dude, this is gonna have to replace my uh this is gonna have to replace my yearly uh shot for the Jets. I'm gonna have to use this one for now on. I wanna actually look at it. This is fucking cool. Check it out. So it's a big glass, but it's a big glass because the shot size is only a football. So it's probably a typical shot size. Let's see this. Check this out. Dude, that is cool. Check it out, dude. It is it is so it's a big glass, right? Because, you know, this isn't a normal shot glass size, but the actual content is just the football. So it's actually not uh not more than a shot. That, that's really cool, dude. I fucking love this thing. Thank you so much, Rhino Jixer, and thank you for all the years of support, dude. That is definitely keeping that. That is that is really neat. Here we go. We got some more stuff in here. We got a we got a letter. We got a letter. Oh, you know what? Since we're sitting here talking about the table, let's go ahead and take these stickers and nail it. You know, just like your mom. A cool thing about this sticker I'm putting on right now is my first ever helmet, ever motorcycle helmet. Actually, my dad threw it away the other day because I told him to. I don't want it anymore. Uh, it was a Scorpion EXO. That was my first ever thing. And then uh, you can't go wrong with some in and out burger because double double animal style is the only way you should ever be ordering anything there so in and out you have your own place in my heart oh i need there we go there we are boom nailed it oh ho ho oh this is around christmas oh my god 2017 this must have been another lost one how you can forget all the hydrogen besides all types of logs that listen to the last better bitch uh uh last letter bitch uh you're right i did forget the load to see these so to complete your collection here you go my bad I do want to see if you can custom match a toy to the real thing. That would be badass. I did not include any chips, candy cake, in a mug <laughs> slash pops of Star Wars. Looks like you got that covered from all the other awesome fans. I want to keep this short. So from Cali to you and all other subscribers, watchers, and fans, have a great Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. Perfume Zippers, this is a lid I wear. Ride safe tissue because you're a Jets fan. <laughs> Shot glass, congrats on being a Jets beating my Chiefs. Bro, your Chiefs almost did it all this year. Look at these things are so old, man. All right, let's see what we got in here. What did he send me? It's a Hot Wheels car. What is it? 
What is it? What? Oh, what? oh, yo, that's sweet, dude. That is uh, one of the first. That's a um, S1, dude. One of the first uh, Lotus Elises. That thing is fucking sweet. I actually think this might be a Siege. I'm not sure, but that thing is fucking sweet. Thank you so much for that, man. I really appreciate it. Rhino Jixer, hope you still watch the videos, man. Sorry for that taking so long. Always been a mad supporter, man. He's always been so freaking awesome. Ah, another one from Virginia Beach here. This uh, is from back in uh, uh, 2017, so not quite as old here. Here we go. You know what, I think I remember, do you guys remember when fan mail, when we had a wall of fan mail, like it was a whole wall because we were getting so much? I bet this is when these got lost. You guys, if you guys remember that, uh, give me a hiya down in the comments. What do we got here? We got a pop. It is Aaron Rodgers, the loser himself. Now we got an Aaron Rodgers pop. We already have a ton of these, but you know what? You can't have enough Aaron Rodgers and no fucking letter. So I can't even apologize to you. I would apologize to whoever sent that for taking so long, but you didn't put a letter. So I'm not even going to apologize to you. Thank you so much for the Aaron Rodgers pop. Thank you for sending in and sorry for taking six years to open it. All right. This one is for yummy daddy. Okay. Uh, PO box 215. See if we have a date on this. This may be uh, this may be actually recent. Um, I don't see a date at all. Nope, no date. So we'll just go ahead and open into this big boy. Let's see what we got in here. Oh, we got a flag. Oh my God, we have American socks. Trump American socks. This is the greatest day of my life. Get out. Look at this. We have socks with Trump on it. That is fucking hilarious. This is this is that that's awesome. If this doesn't scream America, fuck yeah, I don't know what does. Look, look at it. Just it, just take it in. Take in the Trumpness right now, all of you. I'm not going to start on politics because I'm not pro-Trump. I'm not, I'm not anti-Trump. So for you guys want to act like little girls in the comments, you can, but don't include me. Thank you so much for sending that. I don't know who sent that. There was no letter in that either. All right, no brick this time from Andrea Harvey. This is a recent package. I know that. Uh, this was actually actually supposed to be in the last fan mail um however it wasn't in it because uh, uh this package got misplaced when we were moving stuff around uh so we didn't get it in the first fan mail in georgia but we found it and i was like yeah that needs to be in the next one so here we go oh my god bags what is happening in here why are all these bags okay i lied here's a drawn brick you son of a bitch oh my god what is this a history paper oh january 3rd 2019 okay maybe this is kind of old oh you most likely remember me but it's andrea the jackass essential brick after waiting until spring i've been working full-time at walmart and finally had my wisdom teeth removed so i couldn't send this package right away uh last year last year being 2018 i'll cut to the chase i wrapped up a bunch of oreos and layers of plastic buried them in, in even more plastic bags you can clear the seat so if you want to use the trusty knife to cut them out be careful do not puncture the packaging why did i do this because i thought it'd be funny to see you react to the terrible trick and since you like world war ii history i'll let you know that this uh let you know on this my great-grandfather was a tanker in the battle of the bulge but i never like to talk about it to other family members he passed away when i was a year and a half old so i always uh learned this from my great-grandmother I learned all this from my great grandmother after some reading up on it i could understand why he never liked talking about it but anyways enjoy your oreos if there are some you hate well too bad you got them again that's actually pretty cool man uh oh my god this is ridiculous actually really cool man i wish i had a family member that was involved in something obviously understandable why he didn't want to get into it um but that's that's pretty cool that you have family that's like like into that this is ridiculous okay who who has why this is i hope your mom grounds you for taking all of her plastic bags because this is just on another level of douchebaggery just pour out all your fucking bags look at this someone someone needs to stop shopping tell your mom to start saving money for a change here's here's the uh we have fruities uh tootsie roll fruities in here this is ridiculous. I am literally going to kill myself after this video. We have some Snickers. Okay, we can all use some Snickers, I guess. You know, because you're not yourself when you're hungry. Would you just... I'm not even using a knife. I'm a man. Man, I'm a man. I'm a man. I'm a man, man. And we got some salted caramel thins, some nasty-ass cherry cola, some firework Oreos. We have strawberry shortcakes, which actually are surprisingly good. We have the red velvet actually the kettle corn ones are pretty good so i definitely don't uh, hate those and we have do you like pina colada pina colada ones are fucking nasty 
Holy crap, thank you so much for sending in, Andrea. Thank you for not sending a, a brick this time. I really am going to tell on your mom that you stole all of her bags. And tell your mom to stop shopping at Dollar General so much. Go somewhere else. <laughs> Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching Fan Mail this week. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, maybe going to have a hockey video out on Monday. Not sure. Come join me tonight on Twitch. We're playing the Division 2. If you haven't, maybe you can come play with me as well. So, guys, thank you for watching this video. I hope you guys have a great weekend. Be safe. Don't get drunk. Okay, maybe do that if you're the legal age. But uh, don't do anything stupid. I love your guys' faces. You guys have a great night. You guys take it easy and goodbye.